takes a couple of weeks to sink in and then day-to-day uh, -day living out here is fantastic. The biggest thing you worry about in the morning is if there's going to be any wind. Surfing in high winds is the most amazing feeling. You're so close to the water and you're going so fast and the adrenaline you feel and the salt splashing in your face, it's just absolutely amazing. Flying along high speed, watching the water whip past you. You can go fast in a car, but nothing compares to being out there in the, on the water and uh, feeling the feeling of, of amazingness. It's just awesome. <laughs> Just a unique feeling, just you know, it's so fast, it's really it's quite scary as well. But it's uh, once you're in control, you know, once you're in the foot straps and harness and stuff, it's really oh, it's just excitement, it's pure excitement. as well structured and it's definitely made me feel that if an accident did happen I'd be competent to deal with the initial stages of it so I gained a lot. teaching the beginners at the moment. It's, it gets so much uh, sense of achievement when people actually get up on the board and they're sailing around and they've got smiles on their faces and it's just a wonderful place to be. You don't have to have had a lot of experience and for a lot of people that's still a surprise when they hear it. They think they, they can only uh, become a windsurfing instructor or a dinghy instructor or, or a yacht skipper if they've had a lifetime already of sailing, which is um, a nonsense. Before I came out I, I used to hate standing in front of people and doing chats or anything like that and now I absolutely love it so it's given me loads of confidence, improved my windsurfing loads and I've got heaps more friends as well. <laughs> <laughs>